New developments today in a missing girl mystery in New Hampshire. We are getting an exclusive look inside the house where seven-year-old Harmony Montgomery lived before she vanished two years ago. It comes as criticism heats up for authorities, many questioning how state investigators did not see warning signs of abuse before this little girl disappeared. Correspondent Brian Enton is staying on top of the story live for us from Manchester, New Hampshire. So Brian, tell us, have police made any progress today? Hi, Nicole, unfortunately still no sign of little harmony, but for the first time today, we are getting a look inside the house where Harmony once lived. News Nation obtaining these photos from inside the last known house missing seven year old Harmony Montgomery lived in. They show the bedrooms, kitchen, and inside the refrigerator. And you can see extension cords running throughout the house, hooked up to a generator outside because neighbors say the power was cut off. This is the house where police say Harmony's dad, Adam Montgomery, abused the little girl, even causing a black eye. You're doing extreme punishments to her. You, uh, she, all kinds of stuff like that. The therapist had gotten out of her just by playing dolls in a dollhouse. Imagine, I was horrified. I was like, no. I told DCF, and that was that. Like How months later, they hand over custody. How is it possible she got to stay with him after all of that? I don't understand. I still don't understand to this day. Harmony's mom says she warned New Hampshire's Division of Children, Youth, and Families about the abuse, but was ignored. They also haven't responded to our emails or calls since last week. So we showed up to their offices today. Hi, my name is Brian Hilton. Uh, I'm a reporter with News Nation. We've been trying to get in touch with, with the department, the director, uh, about is the. Is he filming? He is filming, yes. Okay, turn, turn around because I, I don't, this side of the, it's not public. And I will call somebody for you. We waited and a representative from the communications office arrived. All right, Jake Leon, communications Hey, director. how are you doing? I'm Brian. Uh, I'm from News Station. Yeah, you just called me like an hour ago. Yeah, that's we've cool. Been you didn't tell me you were on your way. Well, we've been emailing calling since last week. Is there concern here about the fact that she was missing for, for two years and no one had? I, I really am not in, in, in able to get into that because it's due to confidentiality. The department later sent us a statement saying the department is continually reviewing its processes to ensure the best possible outcomes for children and families. The Division for Children, Youth and Families has conducted a preliminary internal review on this case and as is the case whenever a critical incident involving a child occurs, a comprehensive quality assurance review is completed. The statement went on to say their primary focus is locating harmony. Crystal's mom hopes that is everyone's focus right now. Come forward and tell us something because somebody knows something. It's a fact. And Harmony's dad remains behind bars on abuse charges. Her stepmother uh, is also locked up on a welfare fraud charge. And we just learned today she will now be facing an additional theft charge and will, will be back in court on Thursday. Nicole. And Brian, just really quickly, you know, I know that you spoke with Harmony's biological mother, and so she told you she does believe Harmony is still alive. Absolutely. She believes that 100%. She actually believes that Harmony's father sold her uh, for drugs and is alive somewhere. And that's why it's so important uh, that anyone who sees her picture and thinks they might recognize that little girl either call the FBI or Manchester police. Yeah, we all want to get her home safe. All right, Brian, thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to click on the red subscribe button below so you can get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.